Waters View Para Nasal Sinuses. This projection is designed to project the petrous part of the temporal bone below the floor of the maxillary sinuses so that fluid levels or pathological changes in the lower part of the sinuses can be visualized clearly. Indication Fractures Cough and cold Deformities Acute headache Tumor Sinusitis Sinus polyps Contraindications Pregnancy Patient preparation Know any prior preparation needed for this X-ray. You are advised to remove all metals from examined part. Patient position The patient is seated against vertical IR or placed prone on the X-ray table. The neck is extended and nose and chin are placed on the midline of the table or vertical IR. Both arms and forearms are relaxed at the side. The head is adjusted until the orbitometer line forms a 45 degree angle with IR. The median sagittal plane should be perpendicular to the IR. The patient's head is supported to make them immobilize and the anterior nasal spine is positioned to the middle of the IR. Direction and centering of the X-ray beam. The vertical central ray is centered over the occipital bone to exit at the acanthion. Shielding gonadal shielding or lad apron should be used for radiation protection. Collimation The beam should be collimated, includes the frontal maxillary and sphenoid sinuses. Image receptor 24 by 30 cm. Orientation of IR. Portrait. Marker and anatomical side lead marker should be placed on the image receptor. Exposure factor 75 kvp and 30 mas. The exposure factors vary upon the thickness of body part. SID 100 cm. Bucky required. DPMI. Sirf shiksha honari nahi. Bucky samman ke saath sunishchit rozgar. Thank you DPMI.